right, it is game week for Pirate Baseball ECU getting underway their 2024 baseball season Friday. Sometimes throughout the season you can get a little distracted, you get a little bored with the process, but on that first weekend everyone's ready to go. Can't wait to see the fans out here tomorrow, but uh, yeah, it's going to be a cool moment for sure. Now going into my 10th season, you know, you just want things to go right, you know, today at practice and then, you know, get a good night's rest and then go through the tomorrow. But um, I'll have butterflies. Our players will have butterflies. It never changes. Um, opening day special. You say Randy Johnson? You say Randy Johnson? Here we go. Here we go. All the work we put in all, all year, this whole off season, to get to finally competitively play against a team with a different uniform is all we could ask for. All right, Zach. All right, Trey. You nervous for Saturday? No, I don't get nervous. You don't get you nervous. nervous for Friday? Not really. Not really. More excited. You know, back in my prime, just to be an outfielder. Now I just pitch. I do miss it a little bit. I got it, I got it, I got it! <laughs> like I was saying, I used to be an outfielder, but uh, those days are long behind me. See you, boy! Yeah! Oh, it's coming back to me. I missed my only chance, I guess. People are always saying they want to make it to Omaha, but Making it to Omaha is not winning Omaha, and I want to win the College World Series. And I believe this team has the talent to do so. There we go. Oh. Now let's talk about tomorrow a little bit. So look, you guys have had a great preseason. Like it's been awesome, right? So tomorrow, number one, you need to be where your feet are and, and just follow me here. When you have the team meal, get the team meal, man. And then when they tell us to play ball, we go play ball, right? Hey man, like it's gonna be a big crowd tomorrow. We're always on you about hey being loud on the field. I said you're gonna have goosebumps. You're gonna have to hey take it in for a second when you run on the field. Like Shaq, Star, you guys take it in, man. Like that's part of playing baseball at East Carolina. But then when the balls are thrown in from the infielders and outfielders, and Trey gets to throw that first pitch, hey man, we're dialed in and we're ready to go. Fires on one, three, two, one. We'll see you tomorrow. Happy New Year. Look, uh, this should be a national holiday. I truly believe that. And, and the fact that it's not, in some families, some of our families it is, uh, this is what is great about baseball. A group of guys that are playing a, a kid's game and, uh, and they're taking it and, and entertaining fans. It's got just the purity of the game. That's what makes it awesome, man. It's 11.55, so that's four hours and five minutes before game time. Right now, all I'm focused on is devouring this. It's a 42 from Jersey Mike's, a sub above. It just gets us in the gets us going, gets us in the mood, uh, gets us in a sense of togetherness before we get out of there and uh, kick some butt. East Carolina has just really created distance between themselves and the rest of the American. Like you look at East Carolina and you can check every box. Their lineup is just exactly what you would expect from East Carolina. You know they're gonna compete their brains off. I like a little bit of everything. We're two hours before game time. You got the peas out here uh, throwing up the mound a little bit. Opposition yeah. players stretching, just hanging out, trying to stay loose uh, at the game time at four o'clock. We'll put a little south on these boys today. <laughs> Hit and run. Safety sack. Safety, gold runner. Free ribby, free ribby. Let's go, baby. There we go. No outs, tag. Tag. Dogs on the porch, gators in the water, way down, down in Alabama.
Bam. Solid playlist today. September, Saturday, and Rocket Top. I hear you, buddy. Yeah, banger. Hey, flip, flip, flip. Singing every word to the fight song. A little stick in here. First throw of the day, good one. Round, baby. This is going good. Exciting time, man. You guys put a lot of work <laughs> to uh, be prepared for this moment. Opening day is always, man, exciting. It's going to be a good crowd. Um, to get the crowd in it, man, you got to make a play, you got to make a pitch, you got to get a big hit, but you got to show some positive emotion. If you want the crowd to get into it, man, you got to play with emotion. Man. Opening day is always a little bit tricky to navigate, so you can't think it's going to be easy, but just go out there and play our brand of baseball. I'm excited to go watch you guys play today, play with a ton of energy, and get after that. <laughs> Boys are electric right now, getting ready to do some I.O. First pitch coming soon. I think every team in the country has been playing each other for three weeks, so you want to play somebody with a different uniform. Do guys act the same? Do they play differently than uh, when you were inter-squatting, scrimmaging? Um, so just excited to get out there. Hey, I got some. I got some. We've been waiting all year. Don't play for yourself, play for one another, play for the seniors, and let's get this damn done. Yeah. Yeah. We ain't coming, we're here! 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 baseball town and we'll have 6,000 rowdy fans here cheering for us so that feeling you can't get in many places and fortunately enough we're able to get that here playing in front of those crowds playing in front of the jungle people that love us people that are pulling for us it really just motivates us to play the best we can Fire Nation, how loud they got, I mean, how long the journey was to get here. Uh, I mean, it's all 
really cool. Really just can't put into words how thankful I am for everybody. goal in life now is just to inspire other people, show them like just not don't give up because I mean life comes back full circle. I mean your opportunities will come and I mean there's great people out there that will give you plenty of opportunities. So uh, just I mean it's just so cool just seeing my my hard work pay off but I mean there's still a long road to go and uh, I mean I'm just very blessed for everybody that's been along the journey. phenomenal. I mean, this crowd, these fans, these people, my family, my teammates, coaches, I really cannot be more thankful and blessed to be an opportunity I am today. I mean, people believing in me, just, I mean, it's unreal. I really can't put it into words. I mean, it was super emotional. Um, Jimmy Paylor, um, the umpire behind home plate, told me when I was making a change, said he's been umpiring for 17, 18 years, and it's the coolest moment he's ever uh, been a part of. So he said he was teared up back there, as I was when he was running off the field. It was a great feeling. Uh, we've been waiting for how many months for this for this day to come. But job's not done after the first win. You got, what, 53 more games to go? Um, just gotta keep building days. The leadership group has been one of the best leadership groups that we've had here. So uh, we want our team to be player led and coach fed. And this group has done a really good job of that. So if we can stay selfless, I think we got a really good shot of being pretty good this year. Yesterday, Great way to start off the season. Uh, went about 14 runs. Uh, defense played a spectacular game, zero errors. So, believe it or not, I'm going to start off with a negative. Uh, I've already talked to Bristol about this. It, it's a little thing, but down the road, like this could win or lose us a ball game. And be you're a great player. I love you. Um, but we got to just make sure we score hard. I know the time and the score, it is what it is. But uh, you're going to be in there in some situations where we're going to we're going to need you to score hard. Uh, you're a great player, so remember that for next time. Hey, for young guys especially, man, <coughs> two guys come up and just hey go through the game and stuff. Mm -hmm. Like there ain't another team in the country that does this. It takes ownership, and there are going to be times when I mean uh, I really would wish we could go 56 and 0, but we're probably not going to go 56 and 0. So there's going to be time when they have to talk about constructing stuff and we got to be mature about it but it's really cool to just have these two guys up here and it's going to be different guys almost each day to come up here and um, just talk about the game and we've said this a lot in this group to this point has been super mature but if you want to be where we want to be at the end of the season man you got to take care of business it doesn't matter who you play so make sure we're focused if we lose a game it's not because of lack of focus or being engaged or having intent in what we're doing it's because we got beat that game but today, we're not going to get beat because we're going to be super focused on what we're going to do. Let's go win a series. Hey. Yeah. 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 Yesterday was Christmas. If you're, if you're a baseball fan and, and you're in the ring, you're in the Yesterday was literally Christmas. Yeah. Christmas, New Year's, Thanksgiving, whatever you call it. Right in the world, just, just the present. All right. All right. Love you, boys. Here we go. Who's on one? Three, two, three. All right, we're 10 minutes out from first pitch. I'm here with Jason Janesco. We're gonna go get after it today again. Pirates. Get this dub, the Pirates.
mean, I get goosebumps talking about it uh, even now, but last night was, um, I'll never forget that night. I know Parker and his entire family won't forget it. Uh, just a special night, but um, I thought the team showed up today with, like you said, the emotions were in check and we, we took care of business today. Seven, Ryder, zero. Great job winning the series, man. Like, hey, look, look at me. Like, it ain't easy to win college baseball games, so don't ever take it for granted. You don't get a lot of opportunities where you sweep a team, okay? So you get to wear the camos and the gold. Because it's the camos, baby. It's the camos is going for a sweep. So look, same hunger, same mentality as we had today. Let's make sure we're ready to go tomorrow. All right, that's all. Good one, boys. All right, so one, three, two, hey! I mean, the first one's always the hardest to go out there. Second game of the season, the emotions are high, a little nervous, but felt good to get it under the belt. It's great that we put up those put up those runs, but we still got plenty of work to do. We still got to sweep the series tomorrow. The, the job's not done yet, so um, great job so far, but we got to we got to win tomorrow. Usually for a one o'clock game, we're here at eight, start setting up at like 9.15, somewhere around that. Today, as Jaden said, go out there and finish the job. But get on them, stay on them, and finish the game all through the ninth inning. Make them feel like they can't win early, and then just keep pouring it on. All right? But we got to be ready to get it. We've got to have the same look in our eye that we had on Friday night. Because we never know when it's going to be a nut cut. We don't have the crystal ball. you got to prepare yourself for that. So today, let's go out there and play our best brand of baseball. Let's go. Yeah! the man C Dog here, Mike Dog. All right, fellas, let's have a good day. Song, favorite East Carolina baseball memories at this point in your career. Stars home run against Texas game two. Yeah, yeah, that's definitely up there. But there for me. It's kind of weird. None of my top ones are like me doing anything. Yeah, no, I mean, I, all of yeah. mine are not me doing anything. So that makes sense. That makes perfect sense. But. <laughs> yeah, Bristol! Bristol Carter's a stud, dude. Oh. Anybody considering becoming oh. a. Uh, manager, any sport, I 100% recommend it because the character growth and you get to go on a lot of fun trips. But for me, completely different person now than I was as a freshman and I would not have the connections I have now. That was good IO, that was, that was good. Might be the best all year. Yeah, so it was 20 minutes away from the first pitch, hanging out with the boys here in the bullpen. Nice weather here in Greenville, <coughs> Sunday. Trying to go for a sweep, go parts. Woo! Offense, we got to go right from the get-go. Put them away, leave, leave no doubt. Here we go. Oops on one, three, two, oops! Love you, boys. for much more. Guys came out and showed up every day. We're ready to go. So I think the way we prepared for every game and just came out swinging, throwing strikes, it was pretty ideal. Yeah.
a good start for sure. Getting our feet under us and just going out there and having fun for the first week is big. I think the sky's the limit, man. If we uh, show up and just play our game, worry about the right things, I mean, we'll be in a good spot. Here we go, boys! Outstanding weekend, man. Like, look, anytime you can sweep somebody, man, it's a huge deal. And, and great job today. Cam Plunch, where you at? Yeah. 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 Uh, I want you to enjoy this because winning, man, man, winning's fun, losing's not fun. But when you wake up tomorrow, and the older guys know this, we got a really tough test on the road on Tuesday. Here we go, great weekend, boys. Here we go, Python 1, 3, 2, 1.